Just, you know, there's two really good pitchers going at it, at it early. And, uh, you know, I thought our hitters did a really nice job against Alex Lang, just, you know, battling and, you know, making him throw a lot of extra pitches. And uh, But he showed how good a pitcher he is because he, he worked out of three jams in a row. And, uh, you know, I think we left nine on the first three innings, of, you know, from what I remember. It seemed like we had the bases loaded all the time. And, you know, we couldn't get the big hit and had us chasing that breaking ball. and. Uh, you know, we finally got, you know, the big hit by, by Cole, the opposite field home run. It just kind of broke the ice a little bit, but uh, I thought Lang did a good job. We just we just kind of outlasted him. And, and uh, you know, then Knight on the other side uh, did a really, really good job uh, getting us in the dugout a few different times, uh, going through a tough lineup. I, I, I don't think he had his best command tonight, and he'd probably tell you that, but his stuff was good. Uh, just wasn't locating like he had maybe the previous few games, but he, he battled through it. Uh, he was frustrated with himself a little bit, uh, but he uh, he managed to get through their lineup a couple, three times and get us through, you know, enough innings that we, uh, you know, we had a chance to, to get him out of there. And obviously our offense kept clicking there at the end and kind of built up a good lead, gave us a chance to relax a little bit. Bottom third of your war is second straight Friday night. They've come through with it. Pretty big now. What have you thought about the progression of those three? Well, you know, one thing we've been trying to do is, you know, is, is kind of stretch that lineup a little bit where it was, it really didn't matter what inning or who was coming up. We felt like we had a chance to score. And uh, we have a lot of confidence in the bottom three guys. And, you know, some of those guys, I could hit them in the two hole or the six hole if I really wanted to, just kind of like the way the lineup's scoring right now. But uh, they've progressed very well. I mean, Jax Biggers has had some really tough at bats where he's battled a lot of good pitchers and fouled off a lot of pitches. And, uh, you know, that was a big hit. He got that 0-2 curveball and hit it right over that bag and drove in a run. That was a, that was a big swing for us. And obviously Gates is, is swinging it well, and, and Cole got a couple of big hits tonight. And, uh, you know, uh, it, it's just nice knowing that each and every inning we, we, we've got some pretty good hitters coming to the plate. Yeah, yeah, it did. You know, I mean, you feel like you have a chance to bust the game open with anything, you know, a flare, base hit, anything. And, uh, you know, Lang just didn't let us have it. And, you know, he, he went through some good hitters. And, uh, you know, credit to him. But, yeah, when we got punched in that second, third run, that gave us an opportunity to relax a little bit. And, Get him out of the game, and and uh, and then obviously we put together a couple of pretty good innings. You're seven and one on Fridays, and four and zero in the SEC. Just you know what he's doing to give you get you guys off to great starts on the weekends. It's usually just throws a lot of strikes, and he's tough to score on, you know, in bunches. And uh, so he's like you said, he's given us a lot of opportunities. And have we already played eight Friday nights now? That's incredible. Um, you know, just the, just what he's he's done is gone out and just filled the zone up with you know three and four different type pitches and kept teams off balance and uh, you know he's pitched better the last four or five weeks than he did the first couple so uh, that's always good to see and uh, I, were, I was glad we were able to get him out of there at the pitch count he was at I just feel like you know next week we have a short week you know and we might not even pitch him next Thursday we might skip and throw somebody else we we're, we're just going to look at it uh, but. You know, it, it was good that he kept his pitch count, you know, in, in the mid-90s. What was the reaction that I got on Chad's home run? Probably what it was in the stands. Wow, ball's hammered. I mean, that ball was hit hard now. And it was a really good swing as well because it was a 3-2 count, and he didn't overswing at all. He just he just was short, compact to the ball, and he's so strong. Pitch was 90 miles an hour, 90-91. And when, when Chad catches it right, you know, we see it all the time, almost every day in practice and batting practice, and he can hit him a long way. Hey, Coach, what are you looking forward to uh, from Trevor Steffen tomorrow night? Well, hopefully he'll get back on track a little bit. You know, his last couple outings just been okay, and, uh, you know, we've we've got to face a really good pitcher tomorrow, so we need Trevor to go out and give us some, some good innings because it's, uh, you know, it's, it's – I think that you'll see that uh, – 
he's been working hard. I think he's going to be better in the zone than he's been the last couple a couple of times out. Hopefully that'll be the case that he'll be, you know, what I've been calling peppering that zone pretty good. Gates in particular, he started at 0 for 6 once he came back from the injury. And Who's that? Gates. Yeah, probably brought him back just a touch too early. But really what we were trying to do is just get him some live at bats. And, uh, you know, we there it was a different hitter last week before we went to Alabama, especially that Thursday night taking batting practice over there. It was like that that was him. He was back. And sure enough, on the weekend, he had a good weekend for us. And, uh, you know, he I think he's 100% now. This is cold, but you, you stuck with him. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, at 198 yeah. DH, just kind of – What's been your feeling on him? Uh, he's he's been giving us some pretty good at bats. He gave us some good at bats at Alabama, and you know he's older, just a little more experience. He's been through it a little bit. Um, just felt like you know that he can run. It brings a little speed to the to the tail end of that order, and uh, you know just felt like he's been swinging it good in, in practice, and, and uh, you know it's paid off. He's done a good job. Else? All right. Thanks. Okay.